What a waste of chops. A fool and his chops are easily parted. Yes, Alan, I suppose you're right. But, Alan, if you're here, who's grooming the badges ready for the badger parade? Parade's off. <laughs> parade's off? What do you mean, parade's off? The badges have gone on strike. Oh, the badges have gone on strike. You in a minute. Chance would be a fine thing. <laughs> promises, promises. And relax. <laughs> They're not happy with the paying conditions. I'd better get down that grooming, babe. Oh, and Harry. Yes, Ellen? Make haste, for the parade is in but half a minute. No. <laughs> what do we want? Things. When do we want them? As soon as possible. What the devil's going on here? Oops, it's the governor. Tells me an archer, Badger. I have always been fair with you. You pay us a pittance, and for what? We dress up for you and... Look silly. Look silly. Does Tasman Archer Badger speak for all of you, hmm? We feel that dressing up and dancing up and down for another's enjoyment is degrading the Badgers. Mm, Gareth Southgate Badger, not you as well. <laughs> Did you mention about a bigger dressing room? The Turing Shroud. I might have known you'd be behind all this. The game's uphill. You've been exploiting these Badgers for too long. You couldn't even get a rat to dance for what you pay these guys. You know very well, Mr. T. Shroud, there's more to success in show business than the size of your dressing room. Fame costs. And right here is where you start paying. A <laughs> baby, look at me and tell me what you see. You ain't seen the best of me yet. Don't you know who I am? Remember my name. Wally Shah of Edam was never in the forecast. 